gentlemen and beautiful ladies. Alright, this is one going to be one of the quickest videos I've ever made. This is the bomb. This is a great snack for any party. Uh, it's a fantastic recipe. Beautiful young lady gave me this uh, recipe at a dove shoot. Anyway, check this out. Here's what you're going to need. One box saltine crackers. A cup of canola oil. Red pepper flakes and ranch dip mix. Now, I'm going to add more, so what I'm doing is I'm going to add two of these, more red pepper flakes, and a little bit more canola oil because this stuff just disappears and one box ain't going to get it. Now, you can use Ritz crackers if you want, also with the saltines. I use these, uh, these suckers in there, the club crackers, and I'm also going to add some of these right there. Let me show you how it's done. Okay. Now you're going to need a big container like this to put all the crap in. Fill it up with crackers. Now I'm kind of in a hurry because I'm leaving to go hunting. So that's why the camera's in a different location and all that type of good stuff. Not that you care. Okay, I added that box and everything I had. And this container is a lot bigger, so I'm adding even more. I probably should just double my recipe. Which is basically what I'm going to do. See that? Pretty simple. Now, for the good stuff. Now, this is a little bit messy, but here we go. We're going to take this cup of canola oil and drizzle it all over those. Now, this is just straight up ranch dressing mixed. I'm doing this because I added a lot of extra stuff. Okay, red pepper flakes. Now, I usually add about half of one of those. So, depending on the heat you want, that's what you need to do. I like the more the better, actually. Alright, let's give this a mix. Now y'all, after mixing all that, I am going to go ahead and add another cup, or half a cup, of the canola oil. Strictly because I don't see the uh, seasonings kind of sticking like I want. So, then we're going to add some more of this. Let's take the damn lid off. Yeah, it's going to be kicking. Now let me show you what the finished product looks like. Hey y'all, after you make this, put it in the refrigerator for a few hours. It kind of helps set everything. Now I'm going to give it a shot here, give it a taste test. But that's what you're looking at. Most of them are going to look like that. You should not eat these because you will not stop. Damn it, that's good. Last time I made these, I forgot to bring them. And somebody else got them. No, oh, man. Anyway, I don't know what you want to call this. 
hog zone trash, whatever. But I suggest you give this a shot. Thanks for watching. Last thing, guys. Redneck rub. Look at the color on that. <laughs> oh, yeah. TheHogZone.com.